When a metal oxide reacts with an acid, it forms a salt solution and water. Here we have copper oxide, which is a black powder, and we're going to add sulfuric acid. The two react together to form copper sulfate and water. Copper sulfate is a blue substance, and although now we can't really see very nicely that it's formed a blue substance, We'll give it a little bit of time and then we're going to filter what we have over there, the solution over there. And we, uh, filtering means that we pass the solution through a funnel which has filter paper in it. You can see that over here. And the residue will remain behind. In other words, all the material that is not small enough to pass through the small little holes that are in the filter paper and the filtrate will go through and what we hope we'll see is that the copper sulfate solution will pass through so let's try it copper sulfate is a blue substance so we should see a blue substance passing through as our filtrate and notice there notice the blue color and that blue color is copper sulfate, showing us that indeed the metal oxide, such as copper oxide, reacts with an acid such as sulfuric acid to form a salt and water.